Hey, this is here from myhexer.com and today's topic is the building immersive apps. And, uh, what what I mean by immersive app is uh, an app which, uh, as you see in here, it has a translucent navigation bar and status bar. And the content uh, takes all the screens which possible. And it looks really amazing. Plus it's uh, super easy to make. Basically, there is just two steps in here. Let's see. The first, you need to to set the uh, window translucent navigation and uh, translucent uh, status, which will make the, the them uh, translucent and uh, let uh, you draw under the under them. And uh, your layout. I have coordinator layout, and uh, you should to make sure you don't uh, have fit system windows enabled this what happens if you enable translucent and status bar and uh, enable fit system windows you see in here we draw the whole content under the status bar but the status bar is, tra is translucent itself so here i have a uh, upper bar layout uh, inside there is a uh, a status bar, background, and a toolbar, and they collapsed when you scroll down. And here you go. You enjoy the whole screen with the without losing any of the functionality. And if your app needs uh, some of the some of the features in the toolbar, you, you just scroll up and here go, you got everything in here. Super simple and uh, it's perfect for like the main activity, which has like list of uh, hugely huge feed list or basically most of the apps uh, with a huge feed. And probably you, you just look at this emulator and uh, you don't get a point like what's the point i didn't see any difference between the regular approach or how is it better let's see how it looks with the status bar and navigation bar opaque now look at that that's what it looks with the uh, translucent uh, status bar and navigation bar look at this the toolbar takes the whole screen you can barely see anything yeah, that's why you should use translucent bar. Yeah, this looks so much better. Alright, thanks for watching and uh, subscribe and take care.